Wow, I am very white. <laughs> Holy shit. Damn. Why am I so white? Hang on. I, this is ridiculous. Like, I'm whiter than Snow White's bikini line. This is absolutely insane. What if I adjust the light a little bit? Does that help? Is that better? Eh, good enough. The year was 2020 and lots of historical events took place. Mark Wahlberg invented Facebook, a brand new concept called Bitcoin took Mars by storm. And my great aunt Dennis set his first <laughs> And my great aunt Dennis said his first words after being born. I think there was something about toilet paper too, but don't hang me up on that. Anyway, one thing that really stood out that year and went forever viral in people's memories was that scientists discovered that the ultra black pigmentation of 16 spices of deep sea fish was finally explained, including cinnamon. Now, after many decades, I finally feel safe playing badminton with my grandma. <laughs> Have a great Sunday on Monday. And speaking of Monday, today we're gonna, where is it? Oh, today we're gonna paint this jumping ball and turn it into a freakish Halloween eyeball. I'm still very white. Hmm, anyway, let's just get to painting. Alrighty, so I just gave this ball a quick base coat of some white paint and then a second base coat of some white paint and it's time to make the outline of the, what do you call that, iris, pupil is the eye, the eye, I think the iris is the color part and the pupil is the black part, I think, I don't know. So the first thing we're going to do is take our white paint here and we're going to go in a circle around, oh. Oh, this is turning out bad. Oh boy. Okay. And then we take our blue. Oh boy. This is uh, this is this is not how I thought this would go. I I, I don't know what I was expecting. This is turning turning into a nightmare. Oh boy. I can save it. I can save it. Don't worry about it. <laughs> oh my god. Uh, we just want it right in the edge here. And then I'm taking the black paint now. Loading up on black paint. And I'm just gonna go over the edge of this bottle cap here. Oh, please work. Please work. It was at this moment that he knew. It didn't work. Well, that's okay, it's okay. I am not out of ideas yet, and I can, I knew, I knew I'm gonna fix this. I don't know how, but I will. I am not gonna give up until this thing looks like a photorealistic eyeball. So my second idea is to try the same thing, but with Posca pens. Okay, it's better, certainly better. Oh my God, that actually worked. I can't believe that worked. Jesus. So while that is wet, I'm gonna go in with, okay, let's try this again. I'm, I'm psyched now. I know this is gonna work. Okay, here we go, here we go. You ready? Ooh, 
Oh, I love this. Okay. 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 Here we go. Stop it. Okay. No, too much. Wait, wait, wait. Okay. No, okay. I'm, 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 I'm excited now. Okay. Let's thin this out. Oh my god, it works. Oh my god, it works. Oh my god, I am. I am a genius! Shh, not too loud. Oh my god, this actually works. You know, I should just change my name to Picasso right now. Get it done with. Look at that eyeball, that's a freaking eyeball, bro. Oh my god, that was, it still needs some touching up, but so far I'm, I'm pretty satisfied. I'm just uh, clean my pencil. My brush. What? Where's the tiger? I don't know. Right now, we're just gonna make the um, what's it called? A iris. Iris. The iris. Iris. <laughs> we're bloody good, mate. That's Australian. What the hell am I doing? I don't even know. <laughs> oh. oh god. It is the next day and I just woke up. But I f started working on it. But I made the, um, what do you call it? The beginning of the, with the outline of the um, Irish. I said it again. Iris. The iris. Oh my god, that feels so... That's strange, because when I say fish, I say fish. But when I say iris, I say irish. It's weird, man. I'm not good at English. Um, but yes, we're gonna finish the iris today. And I, I, it, it feels wrong. I, I don't even know. I'm having a brain fart right now, I think. I'm not totally awake at this point. But uh, we're gonna do the iris. I really need to wake up soon. Good lord! Should we just do a little bit of green? I think, I think so. I think that would be kind of cool. Not too much, just a little hint. You know what's a fun fact about my eyes? When I was a kid, used to have these um, very blue eyes, like deep sea blue, pretty much as blue as, as this one. But then as I grew older, they changed to more of a green color, which I am really annoyed over, because I had very pretty eyes. 
Uh, you just look normal. out now that's what he said <laughs> oh my god that was so stupid I'm sorry but yeah I mean this is beginning to look like an actual lie there's still a lot of detail to be made um, specifically a few lines with a very thin fine brush in between these uh, colors in the uh, pupil but I'm liking where this is going I really am I'm kind of questioning if I should make this like a really bloody gory eyeball with like bloody veins and stuff or if I should just keep it simple I don't know I'm on the fence. Yeah, I'll figure it out. But I'm gonna let this uh, dry completely before I do anything else. Alrighty, so the eye is completely dry. <laughs> hey, I'm a poet and I didn't even realize it. But um, I'm just gonna go in with the brown here, right on the edge. And then. Oh. Then I'll take my black Posca pen, the other end that came out wrong, the other end of the eye. Let's go all the way around. There we go. Then I have my fine brush right here and I'm going to add lines all the way around and then as well in the inside of the brown that we just made and don't go too overboard if you're gonna do this um, I find a lot of times when you make details um, less is more so just keep it simple just to the point where it's barely noticeable right you can just barely make out the the brown that we made otherwise it's been filled in by the, the black outlines, which is what we want. Just to the point where it's barely noticeable. So I don't know if you've ever looked at a close-up of a um, of the human eyeball on Google. It's, it looks really disgusting, but <laughs> this this black thing, it actually, it acts like a crater that goes in, which is why I made that brown edge to try to make it um, look a little bit more uh, like an, like an actual hole. Oh my god, what the hell is that? No way. No way that's an actual eye. Ew! Oh, that looks disgusting. Ugh! Seriously, don't, don't look at these. Ew. Oh. <coughs> Okay, so I just found the absolute pointiest brush that I could find in my collection and this is actually dried up because of uh, paint that I forgot to wash off. But in this case, that's gonna work out perfectly. Usually you wanna wash them, but... <laughs> eh, you know, there's a saying in Denmark, uh, nothing is as bad that it's not good for something. I don't know. It doesn't translate very well, but it essentially means that even bad things have a good outcome if you just look at it right. It's a matter of perspective, which is funny since we're painting an eyeball today. I'm just gonna fill the tip. <laughs> oh my, I'm so childish. I'm just gonna fill the tip with a blue paint and I'm gonna make some lines 
there's no rhyme or reason to this. You just you just add some lines where you think it's gonna look good. Um, you know, I'm gonna fill one of these instead. There we go. And this really takes some patience, which is not something that I'm known to have a lot of. So. Uh, yeah, here we are. I rarely spent more than a more than like thirty minutes to an hour on a piece. No, I just don't have. I just don't have the patience. And especially now when it comes to a little nitty gritty detail like this. But it actually looks pretty cool already. I like it. This looks cool, man. Oh, I like this. That's the way, uh-huh, uh-huh, I like it. Uh-huh, uh-huh. That's the way, uh-huh, 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 uh-huh. Be damn near. Oh, that looks cool. Yeah, look at that. Let me see if I can get to focus. That's pretty sick, man. It's gonna look even more sick when we add the, um, the light blue stripes on the, on the other uh, end coming out of the um, pu pupil I iris. I forgot. Yeah, the, the pupil, I think. Oh my god. I think I should have done this before the... Um, yeah, I think ideally I probably should have done the light ones before the dark ones, but you know. That's a lesson for next time. All right, I think that was pretty cool. Okay, I think it could use a little more detail. I'm not gonna make any more lines, but I'm just gonna go in right hand, right here on the edge and make some uh, little dots of blue. Oh yeah, that's pretty cool. I like that. Basically, if you want it to look at least somewhat realistic, you want to add as many details as you want. Don't go overboard, of course, but again, less is more. But you still need some details to give some uh, variety and perspective and depth. De depth? Depth? How do you say that? I don't know. You know what I mean. With some dark green as well, and I'm just gonna make some little dots of green in here. Oh yeah, look at that! Right now, I just want to make some highlights in the black part of the eye. I don't want them to be completely white, so I'm gonna thin them down with a uh, little bit of light blue. Not too much. Okay, that was too much. <laughs> That's okay, we'll try again. Wipe this off. That's better, way better. Alrighty. Okay, so let's make a highlight here. And a big one here. 
Let's make it a bit more realistic, actually. Then let's let's take this and then on the top here. We just go down, make it blue. Add some blue here as well. And what I did here was just add a few um, little lines in the highlights to give the impression that it's a reflection of something. Maybe it's. Uh, grass and a blue sky, I don't know. But if you make it completely white, it, it's, I don't know, it, it looks a bit unnatural. I really want to add some, some bloody veins. <laughs> uh, let's see, I have some red wash here. Let's just make one. Oh my god, I actually, do I like it? I, I don't know, I don't know. Oh man, I'm not sure. Let's just make a few. Let's make a few of them. If I just ruined it or not, but uh, you'll be the judge of that. <laughs> I kind of think I ruined it, but eh, it's fine. Oh, okay, I'm gonna do something now. Uh, it's kind of risky, but I, I, I just, I know it's gonna work. So just put some water on my brush. Nothing else, no paint, just water. Oh, this better work, this better work, this better work. And I'm just gonna go in. Oh my God, it works. Oh, I'm so happy. I honestly did not think this was uh, gonna work. But I'm just going in with the, um, my, uh, my, <laughs> My, oh my, I'm <laughs> sorry. I'm just going in with my big brush pen here and where I added the water and just sli Oh, I think it's, there we go. I'm just adding all the, uh, I don't know what you call them. No, I guess they're shadows technically, but I just wanted to blend it a little bit more to make it look a little bit more, um, I guess wet fluid. But look at that. Oh my god, that's already way better than before. It doesn't look as uh, the edge isn't as hard and crisp anymore. Which is not what we want. No, sorry, it is what we want. We don't want it to look. We want there to be some shadows and it kind of blends out. Look at that. Pretty cool. I mean, considering I never painted out an eyeball before, I think this turned out pretty well. I'm not sure if when I add too much on the other side. I think this side is pretty much done. The other side though, oh God, I'm not sure. I'm scared to do anything. Hmm. Hmm. I might regret doing this, but I'm just gonna go on Google and type in back side of an eyeball. <laughs> oh God. Oh, this is testing my gag reflex. I'm not, I'm not kidding. I'm not, I, I like, I've seen everything on the internet. In, like the most gruesome videos. Mostly in the early internet days, where there was no restrictions and anything. But oh my god, when it comes to I, I, I'm not squeamish, but I can't. I don't do eyeballs. I really don't. This is oh, oh, this is grim. Okay, so we have a picture here of some kind of oh god, some kind of red muscle tissue behind the eye. So over here, where it's connected to the I guess the brain. Oh god, this is ugh. Oh, oh, I can't even look at it. 
um, but right here is where the it's kind of like a long meaty tube that's uh, oh, I'm gonna close this picture this is gross but um yeah no I, I don't think I'm gonna do that I'm gonna leave it here and write my initials on the other side and uh, that's gonna be that but I do appreciate you watching and I hope you got some tips out of this video and if you didn't uh, then your money cannot be refunded I'm sorry but that's just how it goes but thanks for watching